Hi everyone, my name is Ellen and this is a tarot reading for Libra for October. And of course, first of all, uh, I would like to congratulate uh, Libras, wish you all happy birthdays, all the best, best wishes. I hope all your dreams will come true and I wish you all the best. And let's see what the universe will bring, bring for you. And we're gonna start with the Tarot Rider White, of course. So, Libras, let's see what universe will tell us. Three cards from here. And first of all is uh, Six of Swords. Uh, Six of Swords, uh, it's card of change. Change for the better. If you have been in some difficult situation, uh, in some difficult times, uh, so you moving away uh, from this uh, for the better. You coming out of that crisis. Um, this is card of progress and movement. Like I say, you're on the move for the better times, uh, for the better life. Uh, also, this saying don't stay still it's time to keep moving uh, also this card means that it's possible you might mm, move a place where you live so move houses uh, move countries relocate or maybe you're gonna um, go away short term uh, or uh, going on holidays somewhere a great start. Uh, we'll see what else card come out. We'll see. Oh, we're having a high rank card lovers. Of course, um, card of love, angel supporting you. Uh, this is card card or to. It's time to make choice. Um, uh, make a decision. Uh, maybe you need to choose between uh, two options but this card will say uh, all the choices you're gonna make you have to make them with open heart and um, really something that you really want uh, choose with your heart um, so of course you're gonna be very, very loved up with you if you have a partner. Uh, if you're already a couple, uh, the month's gonna be filled up with love. Uh, also, this card will say you might um, relocate or live in more than one place, maybe in two places. Maybe you are not living together, so you just visiting each other. Um, uh, like I say, or relocate, move the house, and this is a uh, card of partnership, and partnership not just um, in the private life as a couples, but also in business. Uh, if you're your own boss, if you about to sign some contract, you can uh, truly. Um, trust your partner with who you may be uh, having a joint business this is card this card is great for it uh, just I would say wait till after 2nd of October maybe 2-3 days uh, add to it until we having the uh, retrograde mercury if you are alone, so this most likely you might meet somebody and this is going to be your true partner which will be sent to you by the angels. So pay attention, um, you might meet your true love if you don't have anybody in your life yet. And one more card, let's see. And another high rank, we're having strength. Uh, uh, strength is a great card. St 
strength is confidence in yourself. Um, strength say love yourself. Uh, don't be scared of anything. You can oh, you're stronger than you think. You can conquer anything. You can overcome any anything. Even this lion becoming your pet. You have no fear. Uh, just believe in yourself. Believe that everything will be uh, in the best shape for you. Um, all the difficult situation you will conquer them with ease. Well, even so far we don't. I don't see any. So, next we having the dark mansion tarot. Let's see. Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords. Something um, gonna enter your mind. Something gonna be uh, worrying you. Uh, you're gonna have some um, uncertainty and unclear, unsure. I'm gonna be have um, some afraid of something. Uh, you don't here you don't want to see the reality you don't want to make a decisions uh you don't want the, to face um anything that you might need to deal with here you uh, decide to isolate yourself from from everybody from society and maybe wait till it passes but with this card i would say don't be in this situation for too long uh, you might be end up depressed for a long time, and this uh, I would say here. Remember, with this card, you put yourself uh, in that position, and only you can take yourself out. So when you feel it like uh, like this, um, remember about this card. Remember that about the strength you have in yourself, and you can face anything. Like I said, and conquer anything as well. So there's absolutely no reason for you to be in that place. Uh, we'll see what else. Ten of Swords. Uh, ten of Swords. Um, might be some uh, some painful situation. Maybe it's something that you do wanna. Maybe you don't want to see the truth how it is. Uh, that's why it was painful because you decided I better hide than face that uh, what it really is. But this card it's a culmination, culmination of something bad is ending. Uh, this one cycle of your life is finishing and new will begin. Uh, so. All of that dark thoughts uh, that might cross your, your mind will be over and a new chapter in your life, new day will begin. Um, even if somebody hurt you here, um, you feel like maybe somebody betrayed you, which is uh, again painful. Uh, this will, will pass. This is... Not forever. It's going to be another day. After every dawn is another uh, sunrise. So, especially it's your birthday. So you shouldn't um, feel like that. Let's see. Exactly. The universe truly, truly supporting me. Uh, because I have another card of strength. <laughs> so yes, uh, don't don't give up here because you can. You are stronger than you think. Again, remember that uh, you are you are powerful. You are powerful, and uh, the universe is with you. So. Whatever will put you down, uh, you you will stand back up, right up, with a straight neck, uh, tall shoulders, 
absolutely no worries. Uh, let's see what the Gilded Tarots say to us. Let's see. Knight of Wands. Uh, you might have some idea or you're gonna have some some news. Something gonna be entering uh, very fast into your life. Uh, or maybe some person also. Let's see. And here we're having Six of Pentacles. Maybe some news about, maybe about the money. Uh, but money uh, in October, you should be all right with money. Um, because six, six of Pentacles is a card of balance. Uh, everything will level up. So as much as you give, uh, same amount you're gonna get back. So if you can do any charity uh, financially or even your time, your advice, um, favor, somebody asking you for help, uh, please, it's a good time to do it. And it's always gonna be, you always gonna be rewarded back. Uh, remember that universe will pay us three times more for any good deeds we're doing of course we're not doing it for that purpose but it's nice that um, it's going to be noticeable and um, here also maybe it's a good time to review your balances so you are in control so you have that you you have that balance with your finances so one more card from this deck Wheel of Fortune, another high rank card. And Wheel of Fortune will say that you might um, go away, you might go on holidays. Uh, Wheel of Fortune uh, also saying your wishes, uh, your wishes and dreams might come true. Uh, you might change your life, your life might be change, changing. Um, Stepping up into the next level, uh, changing your status, uh, maybe changing a uh, job, um, uh, something new might enter in your life. Or you might even uh, relocate, you might move place where you live, the country where you live, uh, house where you live. Uh, so, let's see the Witches Tarot. Three cards from here. And have the moon. Another high rank card. Uh, so many high ranks. Uh, gonna be important months for you guys. Um, the moon will say to you, listen to your intuition. Uh, moon also might mean pregnancy for some people if you're mm, uh, wanting to have kids. Uh, also, Moon will say that something is hidden from our view, uh, something not as as it seems. Uh, because here we are a bit like uh, wandering in the pink clouds, uh, a bit like in the our mind is a bit foggy, we don't see it uh, clear. So I'm gonna ask what is hidden, what we don't see. And five of swords. Um, we don't see maybe that um, not everybody agreeing with us. Maybe some people, maybe even five people um, around us. And um, 
we have to be uh, careful because if you're gonna have a, an argument or disagreement with these people, you will win. Uh, but this is gonna be a bittersweet uh, winning because it's gonna be actually not winners or losers. It's, it will feel like you win, but these people, they're not gonna be down, they're not gonna be killed. You have to be careful and watch your back because they might uh, plot a revenge later on. So let's take one more card and see. So we don't see uh, clearly that some people are against you actually. So you need to be keep your mind open. And here we have another high rank card, uh, which is the hangman. And hangman say um, to us, uh, we might be put on pause. Uh, we might put in stagnation. The universe putting us upside down in hangman usually uh, to uh, reflect on what we're doing. What are plans, mm, our actions, uh, do we are going the right direction, do we taking the right way, do you writing, um, do we doing, taking the right path. But here also you might um, uh, pay attention to your health. So might be put, uh, things might be paused a little bit. Put in stagnation. Right, the next deck we're gonna use the Light Seal Starot. Let's see. Oh, and we have the lovers again. And look at um, this card. That's that's classic, that's modern version, how different are they? Well, like I said, this is a great card, card of love, card of a uh, great for relationship, a uh, card great for partnership. Mm, you can truly uh, trust each other uh, on le all, all levels uh, as like I said, business and love as well. One more card. Let's say Page of Pentacles. A Page of Pentacles will tell you that you might get some um, new idea, maybe a new idea how to earn money, maybe a new idea about some hobby and you're gonna be uh, really focusing on, on that, uh, really gonna think how to make that um, to, to come through, how to make this um, uh, alive. Also that means maybe your children um gonna be focused on um, what they're gonna do in the future. Uh, maybe they picked what they what they gonna do and you're gonna they will let you know. And you might let uh, help them focus on it. And here we having five of cups. Uh, Five of Cups uh, will say to us that we're gonna feel a little bit uh, down, uh, feel a little bit um, maybe sorry for yourself, a, a little bit disappointed, um, hurt, uh, would like to spend some time alone, um, uh, really don't, not up for any fun, not up for 
anybody would like to just uh, spend some time alone but um here we don't see don't see a way out of that uh, of that emotional state so take one more card uh, we'll see what is this all about mm. And here we having page of cups. <laughs> page of cups. It's um, it could be your child. Uh, could be some uh, new feeling where you are feeling down, and here you decided not to take life uh, too serious. Which I think is great because I think this card here appeared because of this uh, five uh, five of swords. You uh, here it feels like you just gonna be maybe disappointed in people. Um, maybe you're gonna be feeling down because they don't treat you the way you treating them, or you might value them more than they value you okay so we'll see what the angel's advice will tell you mm, let's see assertiveness this situation can be Healed gently and with love, as you are requested. Yet there is also a need for your strength and truthfulness with the other people involved. We will stand right behind you as you speak your truth, giving you strength and guiding your words. That is a great advice, um, uh, Libra, because I think it reflects on, on our uh, reading today so much. So just like I said, yes, I think you're going to be disappointed in people that surround, surround you. Uh, but like um, we'll see, uh, we'll, we'll see and so far you will overcome this. You're capable of that. Uh, even that might be painful at the times. And now we'll see what the nature oracle say. Illumination. <laughs> I think it's good, great um, advice. So uh, shine, no matter what, no matter uh, how dark the times you might um, be. Sometimes shine, shine bright. <laughs> okay, Libra. I hope you enjoyed your uh, reading. I again, I wish you all the best. I wish you all the great. Uh, birthday, great time, great, great months, great, great life. Let all your dreams come true. Uh, please like, subscribe, um, leave comments, and join us if you haven't yet. And I see you next time. Bye.